Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am Carla, also known as Little Fat Devil, and today I have a pretty cool review. I know you guys like my knife reviews, and I know that you have endured through a lot of try-ons, but today I have a really cool one, and yes, there are two knives, one in each of these boxes. This review is brought to you by Tightener, and I am going to be reviewing the Falcon and the Falcon 2.0. They are available on Amazon. It is an amazing tool, a great EDC. So let's get started with the unboxing. Okay, so I have both versions, Falcon and Falcon 2.0. Not sure which one I grabbed first, but this is what you should expect. It comes in a, what I would, it reminds me of like an Altoid kind of cam. You probably know what I'm talking about, but it's really cool. I actually like it, very um, simplistic. It comes with five, surgical blades and you'll see why little instruction and it comes with a key ring and a smaller um key ring as well so it's actually two key rings now that i'm looking at it and here you got you get the knife you guys this is going to go in my keychain immediately so look at the size of this beauty and the reason why i really like these knives is because you can really just like carry them anywhere you know, I do have plenty of knives, you know this about me, but sometimes it's impossible to carry something that's like a full size knife and even the smaller of the knives are hard to carry. So this one is less than one ounce. This works great, especially for women, in my opinion. It also has something really cool. It is made with titanium alloy, but the top, the blade is actually a surgical steel blade. So here you have it. So what this does is that you can potentially carry the handle part on its own and then bring the blade separately. So this would be really cool for traveling purposes. But also this is actually really easy to um, assemble and disassemble when it comes to putting the blade in and out. So I will show you here in a couple minutes. But the, um, the way, the action is really cool. It's uh, very straightforward. You really just like grab, grab it by the blade and open it up and then close it. It does come with the hole there which you know you can do a lanyard or you can use the keychain which i will definitely do that need it again really sweet slick design simplistic amazing this one i believe is the 2.0 so i am pretty sure there's a smaller version so let's check out what i have in this other box i was right you guys this is amazing look at this okay let's compare sizes so that you guys know Hold on, I want to get them in the same direction so that you guys can see it. Okay, look at that. That is great. And honestly, you can get both and you can have them in separate keys if that's what you carry, multiple keys like I do. I have a million keys for everything. So let's open this little one so you guys can see it. Oh, wow, this is so cute. Okay, there we go. There we go. Look how nice. Okay, I'm going to open the other one so you guys can see them in open length and differentiation so of course the scalpel on the little one is much smaller the little one also comes with the surgical the surgical blade there you have it okay next up let's see how you can remove the blade i think it's easier for me to show you first how to put it on and then how to take it out because it did take me a little bit to figure it out because i wasn't sure how the blade was placed and then once i figured it out it's so much simpler okay so if you see here there is a little bit of an oval shape situation right so you would think that this snaps and that's why i was going wrong the reality is that it actually slides in so i'm gonna change the angle and i'm gonna see if you can see it as i put it on okay so you're kind of gonna put it as an at an angle and you're gonna slide down see once it's locked in place there now all you do is slide down okay there you go simple and you can open it and voila you have your knife now now that you know how it went in, it's so much easier to get it out. And that's why I was having trouble. So really you just need to snap it in the same way, right? So you need to snap it from the bottom up, okay? And then the way to do that, and then again, I don't know if you're gonna see this, but see I'm placing my fingers under, so I'm kind of snapping. And the best way to do it is in this position, in my opinion. So I'm gonna snap it a little bit with my finger on the underneath and then pull it out, okay? So, pressure 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 and then it comes out look now that i got it see it's already lifted right there do you see that okay so now it means that it's ready to come out so all i do is oh, done okay 
So very straightforward. You just practice it one time and this time it took me no time. So very easy. I'm gonna go ahead and put it back in. And again, be careful when you do this, you know, like maybe I should be wearing gloves, but you know, I'm hardcore like that. <laughs> anyway, pretty self-explanatory, right? Now, I think maybe you're wondering about specs. So let's go ahead and talk about that. Specs on the Falcon, which is the little guy. The Falcon is 3.92 inches when it's open. It weighs 0 0.08 pounds. <laughs> it's amazing. Length closed is 2.24 inches. The width is 0 0.38 inches. That's it. The small one, which is the Falcon, carries a number 11 scalpel. So you can see it right there. So if you need to buy replacements, which are also available on Amazon through their store, Tidener, you can buy the number 11 for the Falcon, which is the little guy. Now, if you want something a little larger, but not really that much larger, you go for the Falcon 2.0. The Falcon 2.0 is just slightly larger at maybe an extra inch. And when it comes to the close length, if the little one was 2.24 inches, the larger one is really about half an inch more. So again, I think they're great sizes. Probably, you know, I have small hands and I do find this one small for me. But again, you know, in certain situations, you just want to have something. Um, this would be a good one. Now for a keychain, to be honest, I might go for the small one just because I don't like my keys to be super heavy. But I can imagine, you know, if you're a guy with bigger pockets, you might want to go for the larger one. And I have to say something about scalpel tools. You know, if you're the kind of person that like does a lot of like detailed kind of cutting, these are amazing. Like you don't really need to, you know, worry too much about like the blade cutting through extra things. So if you're looking to cut paper in a very precise sort of way, this is the tool for you. This provides precision. Um, another thing that I haven't said is that the larger Falcon, the 2.0, carries a 24 blade or um, surgical steel blade. So that's what you need to buy. Okay, everybody, I think that concludes the review. If you guys are interested, you have to check out the link in the description. It will be for their Amazon store. You can see more specs, more information on these knives. They're really, really cool. I think it's like a really nice everyday carry for your keychain, every day carry to throw in your bag and have something as a backup. I think it's really, really cool. Now, if you guys like what I do, you know what to do. Go ahead and subscribe, check out my other playlists and comment on this video. And I hope you're having an amazing day. I will see you guys soon in another review.